Hey everybody, I'm Dave Baker. Thanks for clicking on WKYT.com. With the Rio Olympics in the books, we turn the way back machine to a former UK basketball player who had her sights set on the Olympics all the way back in 1983. Kentucky guard Patty Joe Hedges starred for the U.S. Pan American team and the following summer was invited to the Olympic trials in Colorado Springs. Here's our Tim Smile with his story that aired in May of 1984. In our feature this week, we'll focus on a woman not yet a member of the U.S. Olympic team, but barring injury, is sure to be named to the women's Olympic basketball squad. Former Kentucky Lady Cat Patty Jo Hedges ran the offense during the Lady Cat's glory years, and from all indications, will be the starting point guard for the U.S. team when the Olympics begin this August. Those in the know call her the best amateur point guard in America. While at Kentucky, Patty Jo Hedges seldom received publicity since she played on the same team with flashy backcourt mate Lee Wise and center scoring machine Valerie Still. But her role, while low profile, was of high importance since it all started for the Lady Cats at the point. And as a member of the U.S. Women's Olympic basketball team, things will be much the same. There'll probably be people that won't even know that there was a Patty Jo on the court. It's out there just because that's the job of the point guard. I'm to direct the team and, you know, get people in their spots. But as far as shooting, I think, I'm sure, if people are starting to sag in our, in our people, I may have to take on the shooting. The women's Olympic team is coached by Pat Head of Tennessee. Patty Jo has made it to Head's final 15. The final squad will be announced after three more players are cut. One will be a point guard, and you can bet Head won't cut Patty Jo. She wanted a point guard that had different styles from each other so I guess my game is kind of like the running game where the other two are kind of slow down and set the ball up. Patty Joe was disappointed to hear the Russians had pulled out of the games since the USSR women's team is one of the strongest. I really had my hopes to play the gold medal game against the Russians because I don't know they were kind of like incentive but I think any team that comes in will just will just take it as and they're going to be trying to beat us for the gold medal. Hedges says last month's Olympic trials were one of the toughest times of her life. But Coach Head has put together quite a squad because of that tough week in April. A lot of people didn't think she picked the best players, but uh, I think she knew what she was doing because she wanted the chemistry. She wanted the, the right people to be able to get along on the court. Are you going to win the gold medal? Of course. <laughs> Tim Smile, Sports Center 27. At that time, U.S. coach Pat Summit cut her list of players down to 17 following the U.S. trials. And when Summit made her final roster cut to 12, Hedges was surprisingly left off and didn't make the squad. Team USA went on to win the gold medal in L.A. that summer. I'm Dave Baker. Thanks for clicking on WKYT.com, your home for U.K. sports and all your news and weather needs.